Finns or Finnish people Finnish, are a Finnic ethnic group native to Finland. Finns are traditionally divided into smaller regional groups that span several countries adjacent to Finland, both those who are native to these countries as well as those who have resettled. Also, some of these may be classified as separate ethnic groups, rather than subgroups of Finns. These include the Kvens and Forest Finns in Norway, the Tornadalians in Sweden, and the Ingrian Finns in Russia. Finnish, the language spoken by most Finnic people, is closely related to other Finnic languages, e.g. Estonian and Karelian. The Finnic languages are a subgroup of the larger Uralic family of languages, which also includes Hungarian. These languages are markedly different from most other languages spoken in Europe, which belong to the Indo-European family of languages. Native Finns can also be divided according to dialect into subgroups sometimes called Hamo lit. Tribe, although such divisions have become less important due to internal migration. Today, there are approximately 6 to 7 million ethnic Finns and their descendants worldwide, with majority of them living in their native Finland and the surrounding countries, namely Sweden, Russia and Norway. Overseas Finnish diaspora has long been established in the countries of the Americas and Oceania, with the population of primarily immigrant background, namely Australia, Canada, New Zealand and the United States. Subgroups The Population Register Center maintains information on the birthplace, citizenship and mother tongue of the people living in Finland, but does not specifically categorize any as Finns by ethnicity. Finnic people The majority of people living in the Republic of Finland consider Finnish to be their first language. According to Statistics Finland, of the country's total population of 5,503,297 at the end of 2016, 88.3% considered Finnish to be their native language. It is not known how many of the ethnic Finns living outside Finland speak Finnish as their first language. In addition to the Finnish-speaking inhabitants of Finland, the Kvens people of Finnish descent in Norway, the Tornadalians people of Finnish descent in northernmost Sweden, and the Karelians in the historic Finnish province of Karelia and Evangelical Lutheran Ingrian Finns both in the Northwestern Russian Federation, as well as Finnish expatriates in various countries, are Finnic people. Finns have been traditionally divided into sub-groups along regional, dialectical or ethnographical lines. These subgroups include the people of Finland proper Satakunta Satakuntalezet, Tavastia Hamalaiset, Savo Savalaiset, Karelia Karhalaiset, and Ostrobothnia Pojalaiset. These subgroups express regional self-identity with varying frequency and significance. There are a number of distinct dialects place in Finnish of the Finnish language spoken in Finland, although the exclusive use of the standard Finnish both in its formal written and more casual spoken form in Finnish schools, in the media, and in popular culture, along with internal migration and urbanization, have considerably diminished the use of regional varieties, especially since the middle of the 20th century. Historically, there were three dialects the southwestern, Tavastian, and Karelian. These and neighboring languages mixed with each other in various ways as the population spread out, and evolved into the southern Ostrobothnian central Ostrobothnian northern Ostrobothnian far northern Savonian and southeastern dialects. The Sweden Finns are either native to Sweden or have emigrated from Finland to Sweden. An estimated 450,000 first or second generation immigrants from Finland live in Sweden, of which approximately half speak Finnish. The majority moved from Finland to Sweden following the Second World War, taking advantage of the rapidly expanding Swedish economy. This emigration peaked in 1970 and has been declining since. There is also a native Finnish-speaking minority in Sweden, the Tornadalians in the border area in the extreme north of Sweden. The Finnish language has official status as one of five minority languages in Sweden, but only in the five northernmost municipalities in Sweden. Other groups 
The term Finns is also used for other Finnic peoples, including Ishorians in Ingria, Karelians in Karelia and Veps in the former Veps national Volost, all in Russia. Among these groups, the Karelians is the most populous one, followed by the Ingrians. According to a 2002 census, it was found that Ingrians also identify with Finnish ethnic identity, referring to themselves as Ingrian Finns. Terminology. <inaudible> <inaudible> The Finnish term for Finns is Suomalaiset It is a matter of debate how best to designate the Finnish speakers of Sweden, all of whom have migrated to Sweden from Finland. Terms used include Sweden Finns and Finnish Swedes, with a distinction almost always made between more recent Finnish immigrants, most of whom have arrived after World War II, and Tornadalians, who have lived along what is now the Swedish-Finnish border since the 15th century. The term, Finn occasionally also has the meaning, a member of a people speaking Finnish or a Finnic language. Etymology Historical references to Northern Europe are scarce, and the names given to its peoples and geographic regions are obscure, therefore, the etymologies of the names are questionable. Such names as Feni, Finoi, Finnum, and Skridfini, Skridfinum appear in a few written texts starting from about two millennia ago in association with peoples located in a northern part of Europe, but the real meaning of these terms is debatable. The earliest mentions of this kind are usually interpreted to have meant Fenoscandian hunter-gatherers whose closest successors in modern terms would be the Sami people. It has been suggested that this non-Uralic ethnonym is of Germanic language origin and related to such words as Finthan Old High German, Find, Notice, Fanthian Old High German, Czech, Try, and Fendo Old High German, and Vende Old Middle German, Pedestrian, Wanderer. Another etymological interpretation associates this ethnonym with Fen in a more toponymical approach. Yet another theory postulates that the words Finn and Kven are cognates. The Icelandic Eddas and Norse sagas 11th to 14th centuries, some of the oldest written sources probably originating from the closest proximity, use words like Finn nr and Finn is inconsistently. However, most of the time they seem to mean northern dwellers with a mobile lifestyle. An etymological link between the Sami and the Finns exists in modern Uralic languages as well. It has been proposed that e.g. The toponyms Sapmi Sami for Lapland, Suomi Finnish for Finland, and Haim Finnish for Tavastia are of the same origin, the source of which might be related to the Proto-Baltic word asterisk zim, Slavic zemla zemlia meaning land. It has been proposed that these designations started to mean specifically people in southwestern Finland Finland proper, Varsane Suomi and later the whole area of modern Finland. But it is not known how, why, and when this occurred. Petri Kallio has suggested that the name Suomi may bear even earlier Indo-European echoes with the original meaning of either land or human. The first known mention of Finns is in the Old English poem Widsith which was compiled in the 10th century, though its contents is probably older. Among the first written sources possibly designating Western Finland as the land of Finns are also two rune stones. One of these is in Soderby, Sweden, with the inscription Finland U582, and the other is in Gotland, a Swedish island in the Baltic Sea, with the inscription Finlandi G319 M dating from the 11th century. History With regard to the ancestry of the Finnish people, the modern view emphasizes the overall continuity in Finland's archaeological finds and earlier more obvious linguistic surroundings. Archaeological data suggest the spreading of at least cultural influences from many sources ranging from the southeast to the southwest following gradual developments rather than clear-cut migrations. Topic: <laughs> Language Just as uncertain are the possible mediators and the timelines for the development of the Uralic majority language of the Finns. On the basis of comparative linguistics, it has been suggested that the separation of the Finnic and the Sami languages took place during the second millennium BC, and that the Proto-Uralic roots of the entire language group date from about the 6th to the 8th millennium BC. When the Uralic languages were first spoken in the area of contemporary Finland is debated. It is thought that Proto-Finnic the proto-language of the Finnic languages was not spoken in modern Finland, because the maximum divergence of the daughter languages occurs in modern-day Estonia. 
Therefore, Finnish was already a separate language when arriving in Finland. Furthermore, the traditional Finnish lexicon has a large number of words about one -third without a known etymology, hinting at the existence of a disappeared Paleo-European language, these include toponyms such as Niemi peninsula". Because the Finnish language itself reached a written form only in the 16th century, little primary data remains of early Finnish life. For example, the origins of such cultural icons as the sauna, the kantele an instrument of the zither family, and the kalevala national epic have remained rather obscure. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Livelihood. Agriculture supplemented by fishing and hunting has been the traditional livelihood among Finns. Slash and burn agriculture was practiced in the forest covered east by eastern Finns up to the 19th century. Agriculture, along with the language, distinguishes Finns from the Sami, who retained the hunter-gatherer lifestyle longer and moved to coastal fishing and reindeer herding. Following industrialization and modernization of Finland, most Finns were urbanized and employed in modern service and manufacturing occupations, with agriculture becoming a minor employer see economy of Finland. Religion Christianity spread to Finland from the medieval times onward and original native traditions of Finnish paganism have become extinct. Finnish paganism combined various layers of Finnic, Norse, Germanic and Baltic paganism. Finnic Jumala was some sort of sky god and is shared with Estonia. Belief of a thunder god, Yuko or Perkele, may have Baltic origins. Elements had their own protectors, such as Ati for waterways and Tapio for forests. Local animistic deities. Haltia, which resemble Scandinavian Tomta, were also given offerings to, and bear worship was also known. Finnish neopaganism or Suomenusko attempts to revive these traditions, which however had a break, and has not attracted a significant number of followers. Christianity was introduced to Finns and Karelians from the East, in the form of Eastern Orthodoxy from the medieval times onwards. However, Swedish kings conquered western parts of Finland in the late 13th century, imposing Roman Catholicism. Reformation in Sweden had the important effect that Bishop Michael Agricola, a student of Martin Luther, introduced written Finnish, and literacy became common during the 18th century. When Finland became independent, it was overwhelmingly Lutheran Protestant. A small number of Eastern Orthodox Finns were also included, thus, the Finnish government recognized both religions as national religions. In 2017 70.9% of the population of Finland belong to the Evangelical Lutheran Church of Finland, 1.1% to the Finnish Orthodox Church, 1.6% to other religious groups and 26.3% had no religious affiliation see irreligion in Finland. Whereas, in Russian Ingria, there were both Lutheran and Orthodox Finns, the former were identified as Ingrian Finns while the latter were considered Ishorans or Karelians. Subdivisions Finnic people are traditionally assumed to originate from two different populations speaking different dialects of Proto-Finnic Thus, a division into West Finnish and East Finnish is made. Further, there are subgroups, traditionally called Haimo, according to dialects and local culture. Although ostensibly based on late Iron Age settlement patterns, the Hamos have been constructed according to dialect during the rise of nationalism in the 19th century. Westername, Tavastians or Haim people Hamalaisit. Ostrobothnia, Ostrobothnians Pojalezet. Southern Ostrobothnians Pojalezet have a particularly distinct identity and dialect. Central Ostrobothnians Keskapajalezet. Northern Ostrobothnians Pojoespajalezet Norbotten, Sweden, speakers of Minkieli, a far northern dialect of Finnish Southwestern Finland, Varsanaiswomalaiset Eastern Ingria, Ingrian Finns Inkarinshwomalaiset Karelia, Karelian Finns Karhalaiset. Karelian dialects of Finnish are distinct from the Karelian language spoken in Russia, and most of northern Karelia actually speak Savonian dialects Savo, Savonian people Savolaiset, speak the Savo dialect Emigrants Forest Finns of Sweden Finnish immigrants to Sweden Kvens of Finnmark, Norway 
Other emigrant Finns the historical provinces of Finland can be seen to approximate some of these divisions. The regions of Finland, another remnant of a past governing system, can be seen to reflect a further manifestation of a local identity. Today's urbanized Finns are not usually aware of the concept of Hamo, nor do they typically identify with one except maybe southern Ostrobothnians, although the use of dialects has experienced a recent revival. Urbanized Finns do not necessarily know a particular dialect and tend to use standard Finnish or city slang but they may switch to a dialect when visiting their native area. <laughs> Genetics Recently, the use of mitochondrial MTDNA female lineage and Y chromosomal Y DNA male lineage DNA markers in tracing back the history of human populations has been started. For the paternal and maternal genetic lineages of Finnish people and other peoples, see, e.g., the National Geographic Genographic Project and the Suomi DNA Project T. Haplogroup U5 is estimated to be the oldest mtDNA haplogroup in Europe and is found in the whole of Europe at a low frequency, but seems to be found in significantly higher levels among Finns, Estonians and the Sami people. The original European hunter-gatherers that populated large parts of Europe before the early farmers appeared are outside the genetic variation of modern populations, but most similar to Finnish individuals. With regard to the Y chromosome, the most common haplogroups of the Finns are N1C 59%, I1A 28%, R1A 5%, and R1B 3.5%. Haplogroup N1C, which is found mainly in a few countries in Europe: Latvia, Lithuania, Estonia, Finland, Russia. Russia, is a subgroup of the haplogroup N -Y -DNA distributed across northern Eurasia and estimated in a 2006 study to be 10,000 to 20,000 years old and suggested to have entered Europe about 12,000 to 14,000 years ago from Asia. Variation within Finns is, according to fixation index FST values, greater than anywhere else in Europe. Greatest intra Finnish FST distance is found about 60, greatest intra Swedish FST distance about 25. FST distances between for example Germans, French and Hungarians is only 10, and between Estonians, Russians and Poles it is also 10. Thus Finns from different parts of the country are more remote from each other genetically compared to many European peoples between themselves. The closest genetic relatives for Finns are Estonians FST to Helsinki 40 and to Kuusamo 90 and Swedes FST to Helsinki 50 and to Kuusamo 100. The FST values given here are actual values multiplied by 10,000. The great intra-Finnish FST distance between Western Finns and Eastern Finns supports the theorized dual origin of the Finns based on the regional distribution of the two major Y-DNA haplogroups, N1C in Eastern Finland and I1A in Western Finland. Finns show very little if any Mediterranean and African genes but on the other hand almost 10% of Finnish genes seem to be shared with Siberian populations. Nevertheless, more than 80% of Finnish genes are from a single ancient northeastern European population, while most Europeans are a mixture of three or more principal components. Topic: <laughs> Theories of the origins of ethnic Finns. In the 19th century, the Finnish researcher Matthias Kastrin prevailed with the theory that the original home of Finns was in West Central Siberia. Until the 1970s, most linguists believed that Finns arrived in Finland as late as the 1st centuries AD. However, accumulating archaeological data suggests that the area of contemporary Finland had been inhabited continuously since the end of the Ice Age, contrary to the earlier idea that the area had experienced long uninhabited intervals. The hunter gatherer Sami were pushed into the more remote northern regions. A hugely controversial theory is so called refugia. This was proposed in the 1990s by Kalavi Wyak, a professor emeritus of phonetics at the University of Turku. According to this theory, Finno-Ugric speakers spread north as the Ice Age ended. They populated Central and Northern Europe, while Basque speakers populated Western Europe. As agriculture spread from the southeast into Europe, the Indo-European languages spread among the hunter-gatherers. In this process, both the hunter-gatherers speaking Finno-Ugric and those speaking Basque learned how to cultivate land and became Indo-Europeanized. According to Wyak, this is how the Celtic, Germanic, Slavic, and Baltic languages were formed. 
The linguistic ancestors of modern Finns did not switch their language due to their isolated location. The main supporters of Wyak's theory are Professor Ago Kunip Univ, of Tartu, Professor Kiosti Jilku Univ, of Aulu, and Associate Professor Angela Marcantonio Univ, of Rome. Wyak has not presented his theories in peer-reviewed scientific publications. Many scholars in Finno-Ugrian studies have strongly criticized the theory. Professor Ramo Antila, Petri Kallio and brothers Antti and Aslak Ikeo have renounced Wyak's theory with strong words, hinting strongly to pseudoscience and even at right-wing political biases among Wyak supporters. Moreover, some dismissed the entire idea of refugia, due to the existence even today of Arctic and subarctic peoples. The most heated debate took place in the Finnish journal Kaltio during autumn 2002. Since then, the debate has calmed, each side retaining their positions. While the refugium theory proved unpopular among Finns, substantial genotype analyses across the greater European genetic landscape have mostly confirmed the last glacial maximum refugiums to be correct and have substantial backing of the greater scientific community. However, this does not in any way corroborate or prove that these refugia spoke Uralic, Finnic, as it belies wholly independent variables that are not necessarily coeval i.e. language spreads and genetic expansions can occur independently, at different times and in different directions. See also Finnic disambiguation Finnish disambiguation Finnish language Finnish Americans Finnish Canadians Finnish Australians Finnish immigration to North America List of Finns Topic Notes Topic References Topic External links Finnish colony of Paneto, Brazil FTDNA Finland Geographic DNA Project The Finnish Heritage Museum of Fairport Harbor, Ohio Folktinget Finno-Ugric Media Center